Hi guys, it's Amber with Creative Home Life and today we're going to do one of our family traditions. Every year my kids and I, we like to make our ornaments for the tree so every year we make a new ornament and today I'm going to bring you into making like kind of like a stained glass cookie cutter melted bead ornament that we've done before and we're going to show you how to do them today. You'll need to line a cookie sheet with aluminum foil and you're gonna need metal cookie cutters, just any variety. I bought this set from um, my local craft store. You're gonna need transparent beads to give the glowing effect of stained glass and you'll need little wooden beads or glass beads to make sure that you have a hole for your hooks or your wire when you're all done. Next, place your wooden bead at the top of each ornament where you would like your hole to be. And then all you're going to do is fill in the remainder of the ornament with the transparent beads. And there's no right or wrong. This is all about creativity and making memories. Once you have your ornaments filled in, as you can see, I'm just filling in the Christmas tree with little tiny beads to give the illusion of little bulbs on the tree. You're gonna put this in the oven at 400 degrees for anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes, depending on how hot your oven is. Just keep checking back regularly. This is what they look like when they come out of the oven. You can see they're really shiny and they've melted down. I'm adding a little bit of glitter to add a little bit of more sparkle when they hang onto the Christmas tree. This step is completely not necessary, but it does add extra sparkle to your tree. Once they've cooled, you're gonna be able to pop them out of the molds. To get them to release, all you have to do is just pull on one side of the cookie cutter and the rest of it will release off of it. As you can see, these turned out beautiful and will look great hanging on our Christmas tree. We hope that you enjoyed this video. Give us a thumbs up, it really helps us out. And don't forget to subscribe for more great holiday crafts. We'll see you next time.